We saw temperatures in the 70s today, but by the middle of the week, highs will be in the low and middle 30s, with overnight lows falling into the teens. Today I went to McKnight Tire in Jefferson City to find out the best way to keep your car running once the cold air arrives. Dennis Kroll says you can clean your battery cables at home, which will help your car start better. If the battery cables are dirty, then it's a matter you can take those off, uh, any little bit of sandpaper, emery cloth. If there's corrosion on it, an old way of taking care of that is mixing up a little bit of baking soda and water. He says another big thing is tire pressure. Tire pressure is the big thing to check, to make sure that that's a proper re manufactured recommended pressure and everything. The way to find out the appropriate pressure for your car's tires in the cold weather is by looking on the inside of the driver's side door where it is usually listed on a sticker. Finally, even though it hasn't snowed yet this season, Dennis tells me you should make sure there's enough tread on your tires. Look at your tread uh, depth on it. If you're if you can, the old thing is if you can stick a penny in there and you can see Lincoln's head, why, you know, you maybe need to think about getting some new tires. Dennis tells me one way to keep your battery working in the best possible condition is to replace it every five years. In Jefferson City, meteorologist Dan Ebner, KRCG 13 News.